I think a lot of people don't quite understand why creators create. For me, my journey began a long time ago. For instance, when I wanted a new house, I didn't just go buy it like everyone else. I built it the way I wanted. And I take the same approach to everything in life. That's what makes me a creator. For me, it usually starts with one crazy idea, and then I'll stop at nothing to make it happen. So today, you're going to meet the person behind what I create. Today, you're gonna to meet the person behind my creations. Now he should be here any minute, but before he gets here, I think I'll take just a quick little nap. Whenever we get together, the first thing we normally do is get in a rut. Yep. What should we do next? Well, it looks like to me you need a haircut. We should go get matching haircuts. Totally. I need one. Sounds like a plan. One hour later. Two hours later. Ooh, that's it, we're done. Yes, we are. I could wait 20 minutes. Okay, see you then. So, looks like uh, I can't get an appointment for 20 minutes. While we wait, what do you say? Do you want to play a little Jenga? Yep. Is your robots in here? So many activities! Do you step class? It's making my head spin how many activities we can do. Play army then? Yeah. That's right. Your move first. <laughs> Fifteen minutes later. Well, that's it. I lost. That's right, you did. Let's go get that haircut now. I'd love to stay longer, but I've got to get going. I'll see you later. Let's see this guy out. See you later. Travel safe. Well, that was a great day. Productive and fun. And what I've learned is that telling a great story requires the same kind of skills as building. You have to start from the ground up and create.
I introduced you to my clone today because it's that guy, Gary B, the technology me, that makes it possible for me to put these ideas together. Now he might not be real, but there's a lot to learn from the idea of him. You see, for the first time in history, we can tell our stories to the world. That's what tech means to me. And we're realizing that there's so many more talented people than we ever even imagined. If I had the opportunity to give you just one piece of advice, here's what it would be. It doesn't matter if you're five or 103, find your Gary B. Use the tools that are freely available while they're still free and start telling your stories. This time won't last forever, so put your stake in the ground now and start learning, building, and sharing. And I guarantee it that if you do it for the right reasons, just to tell your stories to people, then someday you'll become really good at it. If you realize this one thing and don't make the mistake of thinking it's only about being perfect, I mean this video, I think it's pretty good. It's not perfect. In fact, my five-year-old daughter Peyton, she's the one who took every shot that isn't handheld by me. These clips are of her. I'm not afraid.